is there still a connection between website traffic and Google search results? I found a way to double my traffic, but I want to make sure that it's worthwhile. Um, okay, so basically what this is referring to is uh, the Panda algorithm. The, the Panda algorithm is a, is a part of Google's algorithm that became part of the core ranking algorithm not too long ago. Well, actually, no, I guess it was, we're in 2019 right now. It was probably 2017 maybe. It, it became part of the core al algorithm. Um, and basically what that means is it has to do with the overall quality score of the website. And they, they take, you know, there's a lot of different uh, things that go into whether Google determines a website to be of high quality or low quality. But one of the things that, that, that they look at uh, is, is user engagement on the website. So if you get a lot of traffic and then now, now it's not just traffic though. So, so the question is, is there a connection between website traffic and Google search results? Um, now this isn't a major, major ranking factor, but we have found it to, to play a little bit of a role. Um, so it's more about kind of the engagement. Like if you have a, a, a website with a high bounce rate, a bounce, it means that somebody goes to your website and then immediately clicks back and goes back to Google. That is, that's a high bouncer. If, if a lot of people are doing that, if you're in like the 80 or 90 percentages, percentages, if, if like 80 or 90 percent of people do that, that's not very good because what that's telling Google is that's telling them that, especially if you have like, if they're only on the page for like three seconds or five seconds or something like that, that's telling Google that there's not a good user experience on that page. Now, if someone goes to the website and sticks on the website for, you know, five minutes and visits and visits a bunch of different pages, that's really good. So it, it's not necessarily the quantity of the traffic. I mean, quant quantity does pay, play a little bit of, bit of a part, but it's more important the quality. You wanna make sure that you have good user, uh, th there's a good user experience on your website. Maybe throw some videos on there, different things like that to get people to stick around and encourage and, the, you know, th do interlinking so that, you know, they click on one link and it takes them to another page on the website so that you're getting a higher, um, a higher, uh, 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 pages per session, higher average pages per session, higher average time on site, lower bounce rate, all that type of stuff. Um, there's debate if Google actually uses Google analytics data in SEO. I don't, I don't think they do, but you know, who, who knows? Uh, but yeah, it's definitely, I, I would definitely say that it's not necessarily the website traffic, but it's, it's what they do when they're actually on your website. So that's, uh, th 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 that's kind of really what I would look at there.